file former President Donald Trump. As well as defense lawyers Alina Habba and Chris Kiss await continuation of the civil commercial case at New York Supreme Court on October 25, 2023. Trump's statement Monday will create an inverted landscape, such as calling a former president to the podium as a trial witness. But Trump actually has extensive experience in answering lawyers' questions. The rhetorical style he used in years of statements before becoming president can give clues as to how to take an approach while making statements this week. New York. Donald Trump testified in court as football owner, casino builder and airline buyer. In his statement as president, he boasted by saying that he saved millions of lives by deterring nuclear war. Another time he was worried about the dangers of the throne fruits. Conditioned by decades of lawsuits and legal disputes, Trump is now ready to regain role of witness under extraordinary circumstances as a former Republican president struggling to save the real estate empire that carried him stardom and White House. Trump will testify the civil case in New York on Monday and is at the heart his as a successful Businessman and his danger of losing control important properties such as Trump Tower will testify on a matter. The highly anticipated statement in the case of New York Attorney General Letitia James came after the testimony of their eldest son, Trump Organization executives Eric and Donald Trump Jr., who testified last week. Her eldest daughter, Ivanka, will testify on Wednesday. When court ended on Friday, a state lawyer mocked the ex-president coming to hearing. When asked who will testify on Monday, Andrew Amer told the judge the only witness, Donald J. According to the Associated Press Court Records and Review of the News, Trump has testified in court in at least eight cases since 1986. He was also questioned as a sworn in more than a dozen statements and regulatory hearings. In 1985, he was called to testify before Congress as the owner of USFL's New Jersey Generals and testified on behalf of his lawyer and friend Roy Cohn at a state disciplinary hearing that led to Cohn's removal from the bar. In the first lights of fiery personality in 1986, Trump told the New Jersey Casino Commission that his plans to make highway overpasses near one of Casinos would be disaster. Thousands pages of transcripts and some of these statements recorded in the videotape provide tips on Trump's approach, which he would probably adopt when he testified in Manhattan. They show clear parallels between Trump as a witness and Trump as president and current candidate. The rhetorical style he has used in legal proceedings over the years has echoes of his political enthusiasm a mixture of ego, charm, advocacy, aggression, sharp language and heresy. He has been a keen and bragging, but sometimes uncertain and tends to be protected or underestimated. Expressing in the antitrust case USFL against NFL in 1986. Trump conned. 